Good morning, everybody. It's uh, golfing time. Oops. I have volume on, but I don't have the volume on. It all makes a difference. You may notice things are a little bit pink. Uh, <laughs> uh, color has started to sh uh, shift quite quickly here in golfing land. Um, I was hoping to... Uh, Oh, good. I thought that was going to be a little bit too much, but it was just right. Well, not just right. It was just right enough um, in the area that I wanted it to be in. This is a toughie. This is a real toughie indeed. Um, okay, so I could try and go up and have it land sort of here, or I can sort of try and knock it from here a little bit over and then from there, try and have it bounce up and around, sort of over that peak, um, over this peak. So it starts over there and then sort of bounces over, you know, hopefully ending up here, or even better, in the actual hole. Um, mm, mm. I think if I just try and go for landing, like, on top of that, <clears throat> I'll end up in this little crevice, which will take me one two shots to get over. Um, so I think I'm going to try to go for just a little bit of a, a touch to the side so I can go for more of a, an angle on this here. Yeah, just like that. Um, I was, I was kind of hoping to go a little bit further on all this um, before uh, uh, coming back to you all because um, <laughs> And I guess it'll be my topic opener. Um, I was kind of hoping to get past the whole numbers that were uh, that just kind of like looked like dates to me. So I wanted to skip over, uh, 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 you know, the years through which uh, I have lived and the years before which I have lived, and uh, uh, in this case, you know, some of the years. Um, uh, uh, maybe after which I will have lived. Um, mm -mm. I ain't gonna go far enough. Unless it bounces. Ooh, yeah. Ooh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, 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 Luigi. Um, there we go. And, um,. The thing about having that in mind is then it's in my mind for even longer. And so, like, I feel like I might think of 2085 as, like, a year. Different from how I might think of, I don't know, 2203 or something like that. Oh, okay, good. I thought that was going to be the, the, the one bad spot to land in. Uh, still a bad spot to land in. <laughs> I'm gonna go a little bit further, see if I can bounce on there once. No, I bounced on there the twice. You know? Yeah, you know, you get it. Um, uh, but I think having that in mind, yeah, might have left me thinking about years, dates for longer than I might have otherwise. Otherwise? Otherwise. Um, boom, and land? No, just shy. Hello, water. <laughs> Let's do that again, but this time it actually lands up there. Um, and so, you know, it got me thinking, because, like, I know generally around when I start seeing things as dates, um... Um, like, like I think, I think it goes up a little bit in the 1600s and then down in the early 1700s, but by the mid 1700s, it goes, goes back to me being like, oh, that's a date. Um, and I think it's somewhere in the, uh, 
Uh, somewhere in the 2100s that it uh, uh, dips back down again. Um, and so I'd be curious to hear when things sound like dates to y'all. Because I think that's just uh, an interesting thing to think about, right? Um, and, you know, I'm trying to think if, if there's, there's any, any whys to all of that. Like, I can imagine some whys for myself, um, you know, things that I tend to hear as, as dates in history. Um, like, I'm, I feel like I'm as likely to hear the number 900 as a date as I am, you know, a velocity or whatever. Um, God, especially in astronomy, I can imagine things going, you know, 900 meters per second or something like that. How fast is that in miles per hour? One second. I'm going to, while this shot is in the air, I'm going to check to see how fast that is in miles per hour. Hoop. It's a, ironically, a number that sounds like a date in miles per hour. <laughs> it's two, 2013. <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh, that, that, uh, that tickled me way more than it should. Um... <laughs> Oh, goodness. Uh. Uh. <laughs> is... <laughs> is... <laughs> oh, no, it bounced out of the hole. <laughs> oh, good, it went back in. Is, um... Is, is the, is the, is the Gregorian calendar, is our metric calendar, is that, is that how we should think of it? Is the Gregorian cal calendar the English imperial calendar? <laughs> oh, goodness. <laughs> uh. Um, so last time... We were doing a little bit of uh, literary analysis here in Desert Golfing. Um, oh, really? Really? Um, I'm not being super worried about my, my shots right now, because uh, today in particular, I was playing some of this earlier today, and I was just really beefing it. I might have been on like a hard stretch of holes or something, but I was not doing great at it. Um, and so I'm, I'm currently a little bit lax on my, uh, a little bit lax on my, uh, 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 uh shots. Oh, well. Uh-oh, that's too far. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh, oh. oh. That was almost not too far, but instead it was just a little bit too far. Okay, let's see if I can get this to be, like just to the edge, and then just over, so that way it can go in. Yeah, look at that, look at that, we got it. Um, oh, a little bit further, at least it wasn't a little bit less. Um, so we're doing some literary analysis, and I want to kind of step back from that. Um, because uh, the, the, the angle that we were taking on that was like, what are some differences between this and and golf, the non-desert mobile version. Um, I want to take a step back and, and, and instead, let's see if we can talk about what some of the decisions made in the creation of this game mean, uh, sort of from a, a player gameplay standpoint. Because um, I think we, we, you know, we were talking a little bit about what they might like, emotionally mean uh, for someone. Uh, but I just um, let's uh, let's uh, 
Oh, I thought I I thought I'd got it just in that first little nook, and that would have made me very sad. Um, there we go. Really? Too far? Oh no! <laughs> oh, how sad! How sad! Um, let's see if we can get a taller arc. To oh, not far enough. Um, here we go. I was thinking about um, these little, these palm books, these like paperbacks, which are designed to be um, sort of held and read in one hand. And so rather than being open sort of side to side, like you might imagine a, a, a usual book, um, they are opened top down. Um, and if you can hear the rattle of the car, question mark, on the driveway, um, apologies. I, it's a neighborhood. Um, and so you, you, you flip the pages, you know, like up, or up, I suppose. Um, a dangerous game for me to be gesturing using this arrow. No! <laughs> A oh, dangerous game indeed. <laughs> it just bounced back so quickly. Oh my goodness. Um, and uh, the I was I was thinking that you know I, cause I, I was talking about sort of the the this game having a little bit of of what it felt like a left hand bias. Um, I realize that maybe part of that is is thinking I'm going to hold this phone in one hand and sort of flip my pages with my left hand in that way. Um, so we can get this over. That's way too far. Diego, that's too much. Let's, like, tone it down just a little bit. And let's not tone it down too much, but just a little bit. <laughs> um... Because how I've been playing this game is I hold it, I hold the, the phone steady in my left hand and then use my right pointer finger. But maybe it's saying I should use my left thumb. But then what makes that a little difficult is any of these back shots here. But I think that that just goes to also help show how the forward shots are helped by using your left hand and your left thumb. I say gesturing with my my thumb as though you can see it hovering over my left thumb this is a this was a uh very gracious very generous uh, hole oh that was very close i think we can get that just need to get it a little bit more like that because you need enough height yeah just like that See, I should have got that first one. Just like a little bit more of a, an angle on it. Uh, a little bit more towards the horizon. Um, Ta-da! Oh, I got very scared for that bounce. <laughs> um, I also think from a... Uh, uh, sort of from that, that gameplay perspective, sort of the, the, the mindset of, of what way it seems like it wants you to play. Um, <sighs> I thought I was going to go over. Instead, I, I, have to, I have to hit it there. Set up the next shot. I don't like having to set up the next shot. I just want it to go in. I want it to go in the hole. Please let me be impatient. <laughs> um, on that, I, I think you know this game has a has an interesting uh, uh, balance of of 
sort of patience and impatience um, where like it lets you be impatient because there's no you know there's no no like penalty there's no like stated penalty for taking a long time on a on a hole um, um, but at the same time you know the one metric that it counts is is how many strokes and and i think that this has to do with this this is i'll say a benefit of of being a parless game is that it makes it easier for any of your sort of frustrations to roll off a little bit quicker um, because you are uh, say you have a hole or two like I've had luckily not on 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 recording um, where it's just like taking forever and it's like a it's like a plus 22 hole um, and like it's just in a really like intricate spot to get to and it takes both setup and then on top of that a, a good execution and so like if you mess mess the setup or if you mess the the, the, the execution then you know all these things um, this one looks pretty tough it's itself um, I landed that where I wanted to let me see if I can get that sort of up this hill no 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 <laughs> see look at this this is mean um let me pajama slam that a little bit more mm -hmm. yeah and then that'll hit the side of that where i want it to boom see 21 19. I look at that number and I don't think this is a year. Um, oh, right. And the reason that I then wanted to, to I, I ended up then then playing is, but yeah, 2120 sounds like much more of a year. I think because future years, people tend to pick numbers that uh, roll off a little bit easier. Like your 2020s, your 20, 2020, did I just say 2020? Uh, <laughs> no. <laughs> Your, uh, like, you, you know, so your 2022s as in Cyberpunk 2022 and your 2077s as in Cyberpunk 2077s and your um, 2049s as in your Blade Runner 2049s. And I guess, yes, your 2019s as your Blade Runner 2019. <sighs> and, um, <laughs> and so, you know, round ones... Like that, like twenty one twenty three. I can imagine something being like set in twenty one twenty three, um, but that's like. I think that's much less. It sounds much less likely to be like a pop sci fi thing, than a thing where the date is like prevalent. Ugh. See, this one's probably gonna have to take a a, a setup. I don't like that. Um. Let me in. Okay. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> okay, this will be my this will be my last hole and then we'll call it. I think this has been enough of an update on how Pink desert golfing has gotten. <gasps> oh, are you kidding me? That wasn't enough. Let's go here. No. Curse you, gravity. I'm not talking about that Alfonso Cuarón movie. I'm talking about. thing that makes apples happen. <laughs> Can you imagine an apple tree trying to grow in anti-gravity? The fruit wouldn't go anywhere. It would it would it would it would either just kind of hang on or it would um did I say anti-gravity? 
I didn't mean anti gravity. I meant like zero gravity and or microgravity. I think both would do it. Is this is this gonna be one of those fabled twenty two hitters that I was just talking about being very happy not having on record? Look at how big this wall is. You think you think that it's nice and fair to have that? Absolutely not. Expect me to be patient as I bash my head against the wall. <sighs> Do apples fall off because they get too big and then then they, the gravity just pulls itself off, off, off? Or is it like... Uh, I was trying to think of a part of like a human body that just falls off because it just falls off, but I couldn't think of any. Um, fingernails isn't it. Hair isn't it. Hair falls out of follicles because it's pulled or it's not... I don't want to say not good hair, because it can still be good hair, but you know what I mean. Does it fall off because it's, like, pinched off, or because, like, a tooth, a, a tooth, like a tooth, baby teeth. Hopefully not your adult teeth, but baby teeth. <laughs> Are apples like baby teeth? Thanks for the title, Diego. Have a good one, folks. Catch you all next time. Goodbye.